Hi, and welcome to the Stillwater AP Calculus channel. Um, this is just to give you a little brief idea on how to most efficiently use this channel. Um, if you want to, you can do it the conventional way of just scrolling down and selecting videos. But the problem is you won't know what video occurs in what order. So my suggestion, if you want to put this to the best use, I would come over here on the right-hand side of the screen, and here is the link that will take you to the website for the video series. It says AP Calculus Stillwater. So if you go ahead and just click on this uh, link right here, and let's go ahead and do that right now, it will take you to this website. And it only consists of two pages. The first page is a welcome page, and it gives you a uh, little information about the sites and tells you about the videos. Uh, but the most important thing here is this. The, to view the videos, just click on the AP Calculus Videos button above. So to actually move to a listing of the videos, come up here and click on this link, and it will take you to the page that lists the videos. So let's do that. So what this is, this is a listing of all the videos in the series. Now, if you scroll down, they're arranged in the same order that you would run into them in a calculus course generally, and we'll kind of run through them here. So again, you've got limits, um, derivatives, uh, videos on curve sketching, if you go down, related rate problems, optimization problems, integrals and integration, uh, let's see, volumes of revolution, integration by parts, and at the moment it concludes with techniques of integration. There will be additional videos coming in the future. Now to run a video, let's just go up here and pick one. Suppose we decided to run, oh, let's go to... And we'll just pick uh, related break problems. So suppose you want to run a related break problem. So again, just select the video you want to run, click the button, and it will take you to that video. So once the video starts playing, uh, you can watch the video. Now, a couple things you can do when you get here. When you get finished with the video, if you come down and click on this Show More button, um, it actually gives you a couple of options here. Uh, in a lot of cases, if this is part three in the series, you would, may want to move to the next video in the series. And if that's the case, you can click on this next video in the series link right here, and it will take you to the next video. Or if you wanted to see the previous video in the series, click on this link. So you can move either forwards or backwards without having to go back to the website. So real quick, let's just click on this next video in the series. Let's go, let's go previous. So previous video in the series. Now this, originally we're on part three, Click on this, it'll take you back to part two. So this would be the part two series. Now, if you ever want to go back to the listing uh, website listing itself, you can click on this link right here. Let's go ahead and do that. And so when you finish watching a video, you can always go back <coughs> to this web page, click on AP Calculus Videos, and then if you wanted to, you can scroll down and select another video out of the list. So I suppose we decide to go chain rule. And <clears throat> here would be videos on the chain rule. Now, <clears throat> to get back to the actual YouTube web page, you can click on this uh, <clears throat> JBowen T38 uh, channel. And let's do that. And it takes you back to the original thing. So anyway, just remember, when you get ready to look for the videos, the quickest way to do it is to click on this link on the right and go to the web page and then select your videos out of your web page. Oh, and I just thought of one final thing that will make the videos look a little better. Um, let's just pick a video, and I'll show you how this works. So pick this video. Now, once the video starts playing, it's in the small mode right now. Now, just a reminder, you have a choice if you go to this button right here where it says large player. We'll stop the video for a second. Uh, if it says large player, you'll get a medium-sized screen that looks like this. Now, also, you get to control the quality. So if you go to this little gear here and click on it, right now it's in 480p. Now, all these videos are recorded in high definition. So I would suggest you always go to the 720 high definition P, or, and that will show you uh, the videos in the sharpest detail. Now, if you want the absolutely largest screen size, go down here to the right-hand corner where it says full screen, and if you have a computer, then this will look great on your computer. So let's go ahead and click on that. So this will take it up to full screen in high definition, and you can watch the videos there. 
So uh, it's again, it's your choice. If you want to go back to the middle screen, you can do that. Or if you want the small screen, you can do that. So just remember, you have a choice of three screen sizes, but I would definitely click on this and put the videos in high definition before you watch them, and that'll give you the best possible view. So I hope that helps a little bit, too. So there you go. I hope these things help you out, and uh, good luck in your calculus class.